our last problem problem from module four lesson 20 my friends let's just keep the momentum here convert larger units to a smaller units and we're going to convert gallons which is a large unit to quarts and let's remember that one gallon equals four quarts that is important because it's going to help us on our transaction here now our next step is going to be to solve the problem by multiplying so we're going to just just like we did it on the previous three problems three and one half gallon we're going to rewrite that three and one half gallon times one unit of gallons okay now why do we do that remember you always use the same the same measurement but now you use only one unit why do we do that because we want to convert this stays the same three and a half gallons times now the gallons are going to be converted in quarts so we know that because that's what we need to convert it co convert them into so now this is going to be one gallon equals four quarts okay that's i think that's how you abbreviate it okay <clears throat> so now we can do a multiplication but again just like i did it on the previous problem we're going to convert this mixed number into an improper fraction so three and one half it's going to be converted to an improper fraction in this manner multiply the two times the three plus the one so let's write that down so two here's the way the arrow goes times three plus one over the denominator which is two the total of this is two times three equals six plus the one equals seven halves now we can replace three one and one half gallons into seven half gallons times four quarts uh, let me i think it's uh, how do you spell that heat qt okay so erase that this is qt so now we can multiply we can multiply easily we can multiply um across in a simple way so if you we give that for a, a, a denominator so that becomes easier to multiply with, uh, let's see can we simplify something here yes we can simplify the two the two can be divided by two and the numerator four can be divided by two that makes it so much so much easier seven stays the same the two divided by two equals one that's gallons times four divided by two equals two and one stays the same and that's quarts and what we multiply across is seven times three equals 14 and one times one equals one so now you know that um oh you didn't come back come back my friend let's go there we go so now our answer is done so it's 14 the answer so three three and one half gallons let me write that correctly that's a look right okay three and one half gallons equals 14 quarts okay please review the video have fun with this strange things happen happening on my whiteboard and signing out your coach be good be fun smile and learn math